Hi beautiful souls welcome back to my channel wherever you're joining me from in the world today it is a pleasure to have you here and dropping straight in today some beautiful messages today I mean just the imagery on the cards just beaming out beautiful souls gorgeous gorgeous energy and first time viewers I'm reading this week from an Archangel Oracle deck by Diana Cooper for those of you that are interested, you're connecting with these messages, you want to know, you know, what decks I'm using. And the other one is from my gorgeous Archangel Michael uh, Sword of Light deck as the clarifiers. And these ones today, beautiful, beautiful white light as it goes white in front of me. Archangel Gabriel. Now, Archangel Gabriel, I believe, came out last week. Um, in one of my big Archangel messages, again, beautiful souls, different deck, of course, shimmer with diamond light, express your creativity. Look at this. I just love this card. I mean, everything is light and bright, beautiful souls, but Archangel Gabrielle coming in, shimmering with diamond light, and they're just showing me the big diamond that he's holding here, right? So again, you know they're just saying shine bright like a diamond I think that's a song uh some of you may want to hit me up in the comments I'm sure you're all probably shouting at me right now going yes or whatever but shine bright like a diamond is literally what they just gave me and you'll clarify to this when this came out I was like wow there are no coincidences this is definitely on point be a light to others. Look at this energy beaming out of this person, beautiful souls. Archangel Michael coming in. You have a powerful message to share. Shine your light on the world so that others can learn from you. How many times are we going to talk about big missions? Well, here we are again. This diamond light. Some of you, they're just saying, and I'm lighting up here, are carrying this diamond light frequency, this diamond light energy with you, beautiful souls. You have it. You've been encoded with it. This is part of your thing, right? Look at it. Look at the two cards. Seriously. I mean, how amazing. And being a light, your heart spaces are just, they're just saying exploding wide open. You are really coming in and I'm getting goosebumps again and truth bumps from this 888 portal, this shift in humanity, this Christ light that is literally pouring onto the planet right now and activating so many of us in so many different ways. Beautiful souls, Archangel Gabrielle is shimmering white, representing purity, clarity, joy, and creativity. His diamond-lit etheric retreat is above Mount Shasta in California. So for some of my beautiful viewers and subscribers over there in California, Maybe some of you live near this Mount Chasta. Um, I'm going to have to go and look that up on Google Maps because these kind of uh, messages especially, that nothing is by chance, beautiful souls. They're obviously drawing us to these places and spaces. They're just saying grid workers. As I light up again, some of you are grid workers on this planet. Some of you are going to be going to these sacred sites, these grid points on the earth that have been shut down or have been tampered with is the words they just gave me beautiful souls by the dark and the nefarious beings that also reside in certain places but again these grid points are also being activated all over the planet right now from there he oversees the purification of humanity and the planet what is the world going through right now? Massive purification. Massive. Right? Every single person, animal, being, plant, everything is feeling this Christ light, this beautiful light hitting the planet now. He helps you to aspire to higher levels of light and enables you to find clarity and make wise decisions by placing his cosmic diamond light over you. Now, again, decisions have been coming up, not only just in my own circle of friends and people that I chat to, beautiful souls on my social media and things, 
But also with some of my guidance sessions lately, I've been getting a lot of decision cards coming up and decision messages. Now, for some of you, you may not, this might, may not even be on your sphere right now. But for those of you that I'm connecting to, maybe this is part of this message for you right now, as in you are going to have clarity. You are going to be brought in, right? The, light, the right path, the diamond light to help you make these big decisions. These could be to change work. These could be to um, agree to different contracts or um, a brand new position somewhere else or moving somewhere else or new relationships, whatever it is for you. This cuts away any negativity so that you can view the situation from an enlightened perspective. We have to go higher, beautiful souls, sometimes with our decision making. When we're down here, right, so Christ's light over us, having our angels and guides helping us at this time because sometimes, particularly with situations, we can get so immersed in the vortex of what it looks like here. It's not until we go higher or seek higher guidance, beautiful souls, that we can see or gain clarity on what is actually going on. He illuminates with love and bliss. Well, that should give you the answer. You should be feeling love and bliss, excitement, right? Passion coming, emanating out of your heart space. I always say, you know, the easiest way or a, a, a more aligned way of knowing, are you going in the right direction is sit and meditate, right? Go into this space and place, shut yourself down, remove yourself from the world, clear your energy, and then ask yourself, whatever that question or decision is, if I go this way, how does it feel? If you feel knotted up, anxious, not sure, as in not in a nice way, that is usually your higher self and your intuition saying no. If you ask, what is option B? How does it feel to be over here? And it feels expansive. It feels light. It might feel a little bit like butterflies in your stomach because it's something new. That is positive, beautiful souls. These are the easiest ways. And again, you know, this is just the basics. This is not going layers down, but this is usually how your body, your body talks all the time. It's showing you, it's showing you what it, what's the right way and what's not. Archangel Gabriel also holds the blueprints for your ascended base, sacral and navel chakras. This has also been coming up in my intuitive guidance sessions privately with people. The, the bottom three lit up like a Christmas tree and the crown or the third eye, beautiful souls. Many of you are being activated with this diamond light, this Christ light. You've got direct access to God's source, infinite intelligence, your angelic team, right? So you've cleared a lot of the gunk out of the trunk. They're activating all of these power centers and energy centers in your body. In your ascended base chakra, because your base chakra is all about stability, security, finances, putting roots down, right? Feeling stable. You hold trust that the universe will provide for you. I would say God, beautiful souls. In your sacral, perfect, radiant, sexual and emotional health and in your navel oneness. Because this is all about all of those things, right? Confidence, solar plexus energy, all that big balls of yellow and orange that we've been feeling through this Leo season, right? Activating passion and creativity. Your guidance drawing this card today suggests that you are seeking clarity about a person or a situation. Sit quietly. What did I just say? Sit quietly, beautiful souls. Remove the noise they're just saying and ask Archangel Gabriel for guidance. Visualize his vast diamond shimmering cosmic light being placed right over your energy fields to hold you in the highest light. 
As this happens, know that old ideas and outmoded viewpoints are being released and your frequency is rising. What was yesterday's message? Vibration is rising, beautiful souls. As this happens, know that old ideas and outmoded viewpoints are being released and that your frequency is rising. This will enable you to see everything from an enlightened perspective. And that is exactly what we want. Because that's where the answers are. The answers, beautiful souls. We have the clarity. We have, we have this direct conduit right now. Right? Instead of seeking, right, from other people, places and spaces, go within. Call on these beautiful, powerful angels, Archangel Gabriel and Archangel Michael especially. Archangel Gabriel will also support you in writing, art or any other form of creative expression. Because that is also this Leo energy that I just spoke about. Sparks of creativity and passion, ideas being downloaded. For some of you, this cosmic diamond light, they're going to be literally giving you downloads. You're just going to have these little ahas. You're going to be driving along in the car and suddenly this idea or this solution or this clarity is going to hit you, right? Whatever that is. This is a time for joy, wisdom, and a new trust in God and the universe. So demonstrate these qualities today. Right? Coming in, beautiful Archangel Michael, being a light to others. For some of you, this is your mission, as I said before. Now that you are shining in your true divinity, in your true diamond light, beautiful souls, that, as I said, people will feel your energy before they see you. You moving into these rooms are going to shift the energy. Your words, what you speak, what you say, what you do is going to help people heal in some capacity. The world needs people who are kind, generous, giving and spiritually tuned in. People just like you. My soul tribe, I'm speaking to you, those of you that have connected to this message, this is why you're here. We are all on the same frequency. It is no mistake, first time viewers, that you are here right now. Our frequencies attracted each other. You have the grace and the wisdom necessary to help others heal from all manner of emotional and spiritual wounds. Some of you have been through hell and back. I brought those up. Those messages were coming out over these past few weeks. Your stories are going to change people's lives. You having conversations, you being in the right space at the right time, you having um, phone calls or whatever it is, writing blogs or speaking, having your own YouTube channel, creativity, your expression in your paintings and drawings, your songs, whatever it is for you, beautiful souls, you're always in the right place at the right time. Those positions and places that you are in now, unless you are getting that full pull, which may be happening with decisions to move or shift, right? You're exactly where you're meant to be. But for some of you, when you move into these new places, these new roles, whatever it is, your healing energy, right, is, is, is off the charts, they're just saying to me, is going to help so many more people because you are ready. You're ready now to help everybody that is attached to you. Know that you do not need to be engaged in direct hands-on or traditional methods of support to be of assistance to them. So you don't have to be physically hands-on healers, but this is also for my healers right? But your words, as I said, the frequency of your voice, whatever it is, carries healing. You being present is an example of compassionate, non-judgmental living that people can learn from just by being around you. 
You don't even have to do anything. For some of you, you've just got to go to work and show up or hop on that bus or go into that shopping center or whatever it is and people are going to feel the shift. While your presence itself is a gift to the world, many of us in the angelic realm see you as a spiritual teacher. Here's these missions again and soul purposes coming up again. I'm talking to you, beautiful souls. Some of you are spiritual teachers. You are mentors. You are guides. You carry, you carry spiritual weight, right? We think it's time that you shared your light with us with a much larger number of people here we go again for those of you that have been watching and tuning in to my previous videos basically since I started but especially over these past few weeks these past few months this has been coming up and over and over and I believe it's because waves of people are coming through new viewers new subscribers we are going through in waves through these transitions but again this is part of your life purpose and you're going to be in the spotlight, beautiful souls. I keep saying it. They keep giving it to me. You already know all you need to know. So for those of you right now, I'm going to give you a little pep talk. There's some of you out there that are feeling as though you are not sabotaging, but you are imposter. You have imposter syndrome or you are fearful of stepping out into the light, right? Being around different crowds of people or stepping on stages or whatever it is for you, you're ready. You're ready, beautiful souls, and you will grow into these positions. Remember, God and your guides and angels are only going to give you what you can handle. Yeah, they're going to stretch you. They're going to stretch you. You're not going to just stay swimming around in the comfort zone. They're going to stretch you, but it's going to be manageable. And for some of you, this is why things haven't shown up as fast, because they know your pace. They know your responsibilities. They know how you work, beautiful souls. They know what's best for you. So they know sometimes that many of us need, we're going to have it released in stages. It's not just going to be this big fanfare. But for others of you, it absolutely is like blowing up, they're saying, going viral. Perhaps it's time you stepped out of your comfort zone, cannot make it up and become a mentor or coach to those who are struggling in the world. That's why I say, beautiful souls, I am a spiritual guide. I'm a wellness mentor. I've been through a lot of fires. I understand. I relate. I want to help you. I want to see each and every one of you shining like this because you are all, you are all beautiful souls. It's why I say it so much. You all it is our abundance is our birthright, right? To be living in this light energy, shining brightly like the lighthouse. That is going to be many of you. What you learned that allowed you to make it through all of your difficulties, oh my goodness, and challenges can now be shared with others, acting as a beacon to guide them through their own dark times. I'm speaking to you, beautiful souls. This is you. This is why you've had warfare since you were a child, since before birth. This is why you've had to break off generational curses and karma. This is why you have never fitted in, right? This is why, because this is the light that you carry. They're just saying you have been attacked God has been training, training you, beautiful souls, behind the scenes. You have been through these tests and these challenges for no, not for no reason. They are all part of your training to bring you up and out now into your divine life purpose and soul mission. Shine your light brightly. Shine bright like a diamond, beautiful souls. Maybe some of you need to go, if it's a song, Go listen to that song, 
right? Maybe carrying a diamond. Maybe some of you wear diamonds. You've got to, you are worthy, beautiful souls. Diamonds, right? You are worthy. They, they, this, this position, this position in the world is yours. You are worthy of it. You've done the work. All of those experiences, as I said, God wastes nothing. God wastes nothing of anything that you have been through. It will come back in some way, shape or form for to be of service and in service to humanity, to help others that have gone through similar things that are in the dark, swimming around, wanting that beautiful bright light to come and help them. And that is you beautiful souls this is you claim it believe it receive it hit me up in the comments what a beautiful message oh my gosh so many different tangents in that one hit me up in the comments beautiful souls hit that little like button send it out into the youtube algorithm to so it can reach more people the messages will always align with the right people at the right time but again sometimes they need help they need the push share it out with other people that may need to hear this message beautiful new viewers if you feel divinely led hit that little notifications bell subscribe to my channel i would love to see you in this bright diamond light community literally shining out into the world beautiful souls i appreciate every single one of you i am sending you all so much love and i will see you in here for the next one bye for now